And now, please welcome Father Anthony Casamento with today's Saint of the Day. Saint Louis of Toulouse. When he died at the age of 23, Louis was already a Franciscan, a bishop and a saint. Louis' parents were Charles II of Naples and Sicily and Mary, daughter of the King of Hungary. Louis was related to St. Louis IX on his father's side and to Elizabeth Hungary on his mother's side. Louis showed early signs of attachment to prayer and to the corporal works of mercy. As a child, he used to take food from the castle to feed the poor. When he was 14, Louis and his two brothers were taken hostages to the King of Aragon's court as part of a political deal involving Louis' father. At the court, Louis was tutored by Franciscan friars under whom he had made great progress both in his spiritual and his studies. Like St Francis, he developed a special love of those afflicted with leprosy. While he was still a hostage, Louis decided to renounce his royal title and become a priest. When he was 20, he was allowed to leave the King of Aragon's court. He renounced his title in favour of his brother Robert and was ordained the next year. Very shortly after, he was appointed Bishop of Toulouse, but the Pope agreed to Louis' request to become a Franciscan first. Louis' service to the Diocese of Toulouse was richly blessed. In no time he was considered a saint. Louis set aside 75% of his income as bishop to feed the poor and maintain churches. Each day he fed 25 poor people at his table. He was canonised in 1317 by Pope John XXII, one of his former teachers. I'm Father Anthony and that was Saint of the Day. For more episodes, go to cradio.org.au.